Hey everybody, Jamie here, and with fall in full swing, I've been wearing scarves all day, air day. Which basically means the same two scarves on repeat. So today it's time to expand the closet by showing you three different ways to make your own infinity scarf. Let's do it, girl. Okay, so for this craft, you'll need scissors, a needle and thread or hot glue, and any old shirt. If you want a multicolored scarf, grab a variety of shirts in complementary colors. Now there are so many different ways that you can make your own scarf from scratch, so I'll just show you three different options and then you can take it from there. Let's start with the easiest scarf first. One, the stretchy stranded scarf. The first step is to cut your shirt into strips. Snip away the bottom hem of your shirt and then trim below the armpits in a straight line. With this new rectangular piece of fabric, cut one to two inch strips from one side of your shirt to the other. You can keep the strips the same size or vary the widths to mix things up visually. Once all of your strip loops have been cut, the next step is to stretch them out and curl them up. Pull on each strip gently so that it curls into a thin strand. Then grab all of your loops and pull them as wide as you can to make them as long as you can. Step three, all that's left to do is bind your loops together. Cut a thin strip from your t-shirt sleeve. Gather up all of your strands, slip your strip through their loops, and then bind them together by tying your strip into a tight knot. And that's all there is to it. Let your long scarf dangle as a fashion statement or loop it around several times for a more traditional look. Two, the braided stretchy stranded scarf. Starting with the knot from your finished stretchy stranded scarf, measure out a third of the scarf's material and cut it neatly using your scissors. Separate these loose strands into three equal sections. Beginning at the bind, braid your strands from one end to the other. Tie off the end of your braid with another small strip from your t-shirt. Take the opposite end of your scarf and layer your strands over the leftover strands from your knotted braid. Sew, glue, or knot the disconnected ends together. To hide the mess, cover it all up in one last wide strip of fabric. And boom, you now have a sassy stranded scarf with a beautiful braid accent. And three, the intricate infinity scarf. Repeat steps one and two from the stretchy stranded scarf to create shirt strips, but this time cut your strips in a variety of widths. I used three shirts to make loops in different colors. When finished, separate your loops into groups based on how wide or thin they are. The next step is to manipulate your loops for decorating. Feel free to cut a few or all of your loops into long strands. Then then, keeping within each of your groups, randomly choose strands to twist together, braid together, or simply leave be. This will create a variety of new decorative strands that will be the puzzle pieces for your scarf. Speaking of which, let's put those puzzle pieces together. Have fun layering your decorative strands in, out, and around one another until you've compiled your desired look. Once you've achieved the look you're going for, all that's left to do is to connect everything together. Take your time matching up the tops and bottoms of your decorative strands. Again, you can sew, glue, or knot them together. If you made a messy cluster where you connected your scarf together, feel free to bind it with a strip of t-shirt like you did for your other scarves. And there you have it, your own intricate infinity scarf. Now like I said, there's an infinite amount of ways in order to make an infinity scarf. Try out more shirt colors and patterns. Or decorate your strands by stringing on beads or pinning on decorations. Instead of extra t-shirt material, you could substitute for lace or leather in order to better fit your personality. Honestly, as long as your scarf looks good and feels good, then you're all good. What type of infinity scarf did you make? Tweet me at Jamie Petito, Instagram me at Hey Jamie, or let me know on my fan page on Facebook. If you love this DIY, click the video on your left to see even another way to make a scarf out of an old t-shirt. And click the video on your right to transform your t-shirt into other accessories from a headband to a belt. We did it girl, I'm Jamie and you're on girl.com.